We're now going to be looking at four areas available at the Westwood Library and the Norwood Library. Art, literature, music, and philosophy. Under art, some of the courses that are available where the teacher shows the paintings and talks about them. Great artists of the Italian Renaissance. A history, and that's by William Kloss, the Smithsonian Institution. A history of European art. William Kloss, again, Smithsonian Institute. Monet to Van Gogh, a history of Impressionism. Rijn Vertel, the University of Texas at Dallas. Then we're going to get into literature. The, uh, these are lectures on books that may cause you to want to either read the books or learn about the books. Uh, William Shakespeare, Comedies, Histories, and Tragedies. Professor Sasha at Dartmouth. Great authors of the Western literary tradition. It's 84 lectures. Arnold Weinstein at Brown, Claudia Brodsky at Princeton, and Victor Brumbent at Princeton. Sorry, it's Claudia Brodsky Lacour at Princeton. Classics of American Literature, 84 lectures, Arnold Weinstein at Brown. Books that have made history, books that can change your life. Rufus Fears, University of Oklahoma. Master works of early 20th century literature. Professor David Thornborn, Massachusetts Institute of Technology. How to read and understand Shakespeare. Mark Connor, Washington and Lee University. Masterpieces of the Imaginative Mind, Eric Rabkin, University of Michigan. And then we're going to get to music. How to listen to and understand great music. 48 lectures. Professor Greenberg, San Francisco Conservatory of Music. 30 great orchestral works. Professor Greenberg, San Francisco Symphony. Concert masterworks. Professor Greenberg, San Francisco Symphony. Then we're going to do a few on philosophy, something that you don't often get in high school, but suddenly people realize when they're going through college it might have been something they might have found interesting. Great minds of the Western intellectual tradition. Lecturers from 12 different universities around the world. Great ideas of philosophy. Daniel Robinson from Georgetown and Oxford universities. So we're now going to just say a few things in detail about a few of these courses. Artists who have changed our view of the world from an A to Van Gogh. Richard Brattel, University of Texas. You're going to sit there and look at the paintings while he discusses what is good and what he enjoys. Monet Renoir, Cezanne, Cassatt, Toulouse-Lautrec, and Van Gogh. 400 works of art will be reviewed in this course. Shakespeare comedies. History and Tragedies, a very popular course at Dartmouth, Peter Sasha. He does a review of each of these plays, so you might want to read them or not read them, but at least know something about them. The history behind them, what, where did they come from? Twelfth Night, Taming of the Shrew, Merchant of Venice, Measure for Measure, Richard III, Richard II, Henry IV, Henry V, Romeo and Juliet, Trillius and Cressida, Julius Caesar, Hamlet, Othello, King Lear and Macbeth. Uh, a wonderful opportunity to learn about these and maybe read them with some understanding of what the history of the background is. Great authors of the Western literary tradition. 84 lectures, five outstanding professors, seven literary geniuses will be reviewed. Uh, just a smattering of some of the people that are talked about in the books. Genesis, Job, Homer, Aeschylus, Euripides, Herodotus. Thucydides, Aristophanes, Plato, Virgil, Augustine, Dante, Chaucer, Shakespeare, Milton, Pope, Swift, Voltaire, Austin, Melville, Whitman, Dick, Dickens, Dostoevsky, Wilde, Yeats, Joyce, and Faulkner, and Camus. I mean, uh, uh, something it would be good to learn a little bit about each of these people and maybe be motivated to read some of their books. All of these, again, are available on DVD at the libraries. The next one would be Classics of American Literature, one of the most popular courses at Brown University. Arnold Weinstein, Professor, Melville, Whitman, Faulkner, Hemingway, Emerson Thoreau, Pope, Hawthorne, Melville, Whitman, Stowe, Dickinson, Twain, J. 
James Crane Frost, T.S. Eliot, Fitzgerald, Hemingway, Faulkner, Steinbrecht, O'Neill, Williams, and Morrison. The lecture on each of these, their major books, to maybe want you to go read them and know what you're reading, appreciate more what you're reading, with an outstanding professor doing all of this, sitting in your living room, watching it on DVD. Books that have made history, books that can change your life. J. Rufus Fears, University of Oklahoma. This is his review of what the, the books that have, he believes has changed the world. Homer, the Iliad, the Gospel of Mark, the Book of Job, the, the uh, Bhagavad Gita, the Koran, Aeschylus, Euripides, Plato, Dante, Virgil, Confucius, Thoreau, Gandhi, and Churchill. Listening to and understanding great music, Robert Greenberg, San Francisco. If you're a big donor to the San Francisco, Francisco, Francisco they bring you in an hour before for a lecture by this guy. Uh, he's uh, an outstanding lecturer. This first course, 48 lectures. Beethoven, Bach, Handel, Hayden, Mozart, Chopin, Verdi, Wagner, Brahms, Tchaikovsky. A little bit, a little flavor, you might discover music that you'd like for the rest of your life. The same guy, the 30 greatest orchestral works. Vivaldi, Bach, Hayden, Mozart, Beethoven, Schubert, Mendelssohn, Brahms, Tchaikovsky, Dvorak, Strauss, Mahler, Romana, Rachmaninoff, Dubisi, and Shakhtoskovich. Finally, the same, he has one more lecture also uh, that I'm not going to go in detail. Great Ideas of Philosophy, Daniel Robinson, Oxford University at Georgetown. 60 lectures, what can we know, what we ought to know to act, how should we order our lives together? These are questions that he puts in his lectures. Did the Greeks invent philosophy? Herodotus, Socrates, Plato, Aristotle. Bacon, Descartes, Newton and Hobbes, Locke and Freud. Who are these people? How did they influence thinking in the world because of their great work? The DVDs of the courses are available right now for you at the Westwood Library and the Norwood Library.